Hey everybody, Steph here. How's it going for you? We are heading into the third week of our September accountability uh, 21 day challenge and I'm feeling really excited about it for two big reasons. One, a lot of people say it takes three weeks to really start establishing new habits and I really think it takes longer to like firmly get them but after about three weeks you get over that hump of just really getting them into your day. So if you've been able to keep up for the last two weeks, push forward. This third week is going to be the time when it makes it or breaks it for you and, and you can start really getting those habits clicking along. The second reason I'm super excited is that this is my 100th video I've made for YouTube for this channel, you guys. I'm super excited. I can't believe how far I've come in 100 videos. I mean, if you look back at my first video, and like you don't have to, but if you do, it, it's like night and day in just my house, um, how I feel about approaching life as a mom, and also just how I feel about myself. I'm not overwhelmed. I'm not having to sit on the couch and cry about not doing my dishes. I just get them done. So I've made some huge changes and I'm really proud of myself and I just wanna say thank you to everybody in our amazing community that supports me and supports each other and leaves the nicest comments and the best tips and everybody's just so great and I'm so glad that I found this community to be my accountability partner and now we have and now we all have each other to uh, help each other along so I'm just really excited I just think that's pretty cool if you had told me two years ago that I would have a YouTube channel about being a clean house person, I would have laughed in your face. So there you go, 100 channel, 100 videos later, I'm kinda doing it. Anyways, so my Friday went pretty well. I got all my morning routine and my daytime stuff done and then evening routine, I kinda let it go and we just started the weekend and hung out. So it's Sunday now. You can probably hear I'm having a hard time kicking this cold, <laughs> but my mom's here now. And uh, so I had a good rest today and hopefully it will just peter out this week. Please, cold. I've had enough. So this is how my Friday went and a couple of things we did this weekend. Good morning. My bed is made. I had my shower. I'm just going to start my morning routine, go downstairs, have some breakfast, empty the dishwasher. Okay, one thing quickly before I go downstairs, I'm just going to start my laundry. My kids are still little, so they can't really bring their clothes to the laundry room yet. They put their... Close in a laundry basket sometimes, but we're working on it. Um, so one thing I do is I just quickly whip through all the rooms of the house. I grab like my dirty laundry from yesterday, their laundry, and I throw it in the washing machine. So that's how I do my laundry. I don't have a system yet. My kids are just too young to like participate. So it's just me, so it really doesn't matter. Okay, so I'm just finishing up my swish and swipe and I'm actually in a new bathroom this morning that you may have not seen. It's our guest bathroom downstairs. And so this is a question I get all the time. Do I swish and swipe every single bathroom in my house every day? No, I do not. I always do the main one and usually the one in my master bathroom because it gets makeup and stuff all over it. But our kids room one that only they brush their teeth in and wash their hands, like there's no makeup, there's no hairspray, no product. I do every couple days. And this downstairs guest one, I do like once every two weeks, but I'm doing it special today because my mom is coming this weekend, yay! Um, so we're having guests, so I'm gonna just quickly run over it and do it, but it's clean because no one uses it. We literally never use it. So that's how often I do my bathrooms. Okay, zone cleaning. I'm gonna try and get my stove, vent, and garbage cupboard done, we'll see. Okay, so I didn't get to my garbage cupboard, but I did a really good job on my oven, and I took the time to really clean the glass, and so, I'm glad I did that because, yeah, it means it'll be easier next time. So if you have an oven that needs attention, spend your whole 15 minutes, spend two 15 minute sessions, whatever. Just get it clean once and then it will stay clean the more you do it. So yeah, it was a good weekend. The greatest thing was my car and purse took like zero time at all and I was like happily driving around in a reasonably clean car, which is like not something that always happens for me. So anyways, day 12, Monday tomorrow, we are going to start with our regular Monday morning routine, which is getting dressed, making the bed, emptying the dishwasher, doing our swish and swipe of our bathrooms, and starting a load of laundry. Then the daily focus tomorrow is weekly home blessing hour. So that is our six or seven tasks. I gotta change my paper. Garbages, sheets, washing them, and switching them out, 
mirrors and doors, vacuuming, mopping, dusting, and there's also magazines and newspapers. So if you read magazines and newspapers, this is the day to just go through your house and purge those. I don't. I just read everything online, so that's one that I skip. So, weekly home blessing. Then, our evening routine, shining your sink, getting your hot spot cleared, starting the dishwasher, laying out clothes for tomorrow, checking your calendar and setting things out for tomorrow, and folding your clothes and putting them away. So this is the week, like I say, where it's going to start really clicking in, and this is where habits are going to start really getting established. So if there's something you've been struggling with, pick that one thing and focus on it this week. So welcome to week three, you guys. I'm so excited. Thank you for sticking with me, and thank you again for supporting my channel and, and just for being here in this community. It's been a really special and amazing experience. So I'll see you tomorrow. Happy Monday. Hope you had a great weekend. Bye.